Yeah, it's like, hey, it's Charles again. <laughs> I'm still smiling. They, uh, um, yeah, the lights are still out. Yesterday, they, uh, or somewhere around, I don't know, 8 o'clock or so, it was dark, and the uh, electric power came on for a little bit in the neighborhood and whatnot, and then um, there was this glowing in the sky, a blue glow filled the sky to the south of us, and then it went like a blue glow, and then it went to a blue red, I want to say there was some red in there. But it was mainly a blue glow that filled the sky. It was beautiful. I know it was something bad that happened. Probably electrical. But it was... That had something to do with the power coming back on. But it was... It filled the sky in this blue glow. That was real neat. Um, I laughed about it. Gave a hoot about it. And then uh, uh, the generator was, was out of fuel by the time I walked back up. It's got about two hours of fuel. Depending on how hard you run it, it might be two hours and 15 minutes. <laughs> Depending on if you run it hard or not. The, uh, um, that's the second tank of fuel that I ran through it. Um, how did it work? My deep cell battery lasted for a few hours running internet, but I haven't charged the battery forever. I mean, I it's been well over a year or two or more since I've charged it because I haven't needed it, which was a big mistake. Because now I need it and it's not charged up, yada yada. So anyway, from now on, I'll just keep it charged up. I could run it permanently, you know, just run it permanently and, well, keep it up to that optimum level of charge and run it up and down like a yo-yo. The horn went off again. That means life and safety is at risk somewhere. Then it came on again right afterwards. That means they couldn't get anybody. So then they had to do the second call. That means life and safety is a risk somewhere. Uh, property, property or life. One. Well, somebody else has had a problem. They, uh, it's like 54 degrees in the house, but that's okay. I'm like camping. This is like camping, isn't it? Camping in the house. I got my light going, my little electric lantern. It's this little lantern lit. Uh, clothing. I got this thick blanket I got in Korea. It's a fuzzy thick blanket, like, I don't know, half an inch thick of fuzz. Really warm. I love it in the winter. Then I've got it tots with a with a quilt made by my mom. That's nice. Helps hold the heat in. The uh, um yeah, I ate enough food, which was good. Get me through the night. Just been. Uh, it's like camping, you know, you don't have any uh, electronics and toys and whatnot to keep you alive or to keep you, do you think it's all motivated, but you're consuming and you're, it's, it's really uh, going in the other direction towards consuming instead of creating, so it's kind of different. Um... Yeah, 
it's cold, it's dark, it's only like 54, which isn't bad. Um, it's supposed to get down to 32 last night. I bet that's what it is out there right now. Uh, we're supposed to get more snow, but then it's just supposed to turn into rain and, that, and just rain and rain and be more rain and always be rain forever. Days of rain. I mean, it's not. I'm surprised it hasn't started snowing out there right now. Like snow, snow, and more snow, and then even more snow before it turns over to rain. But I don't know what the weather's doing. Anyway, I, I'm doing okay. You know, I'm making it. I did uh, the yeah, the internet ran for a while. I can't get like data on my phone local phone subscribers they don't give they don't allow people to run data on their phones i guess because it's an emergency uh they don't allow people uploading or or apps useless data on phone to be tr making traffic so they just don't they shut it off I've seen cell service has been pretty spotty too here at home at the same place. It just it comes and it goes. Sometimes it has any cell service at all and often not. It's like zero or one bar because of the probably the weather. That's just something to remember. If I can turn the router on and keep it powered up, I have internet. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, that's an update. That's what I'm doing. Probably uh, have to get up and, and start the generator. Uh, yeah, start the generator later today. And charge up the batteries, eat food, <laughs> turn the heat on, <laughs> refrigerate the food, you know, that stuff. And then uh, before it runs out in two hours. <laughs> Yeah, that's how it's going. So, okay, there we go. <laughs>